What is going on, Punk Nation, and welcome back to a special mod spotlight. These two mods sitting in front of me is going to make my warehouse videos awesome. I want to give a special thanks to two people, Iconic Upgrades for the truck and trailer, and Elliot uh, for the warehouse from Expandables Modding. So the trucks, uh, we have a Freightliner, and then we have Pubs. So we have single or yeah, single axle and tandem axle. You got hoses that work, that move with the truck. And then one of these, I didn't set on these, but they have ramps that'll come out. We can display that later. So we got the FedEx out here. We have Amazon Prime. You can do the back colors to make the decals pop. We of course got UPS. Need to get a brown for the trailer. And then we got Walmart over here with a blue chrome. Very nice. We'll just pop through these doors. These doors are amazing. We got some bays over here. So like this one. Nice and flat. You can walk right in. So then you have wood floors and this one. You gotta find one with metal and then this one is metal I did metal because this is a reefer oh yeah then the reefer let's look at that real quick the little AC unit you can do there's two colors so you have gray on top and then the blue on bottom so you can coordinate it to the trailer there's plenty of decals out there And then you have some inside loading here. So we have the Home Depot truck. I'm going to probably get a step deck trailer. I just don't have one right now. But we have a flatbed. So flat trailer. Not bad. We can still use it. Very nice. Orange. And then you have a bunch of storage racks. And then there was a mod that just came out. Which I'm going to spawn it in. We're going to do that one too. Because this kind of themely goes with it. Let me get out here. This is a really cool uh, palette. So it's in mist. Scroll through here. And here is the portable shelving. It's going to come as a palette. And then you get into the palette. And then you can assemble it. We'll just go for the big daddy. So you can do whatever colors you want. And this is how it comes. You press E to get into it. And it folds out. So this is kind of like a warehouse mod stream. Or mod spotlight, I should say. Not stream. <laughs> so it looks amazing. So hope you guys enjoyed today's mod spotlight. Uh, very short and sweet. Hasn't been very mods out there. I'm getting a whole bunch of pallet stuff. Um, actually, yeah, we need to go take a look at the ramps. Um, oh, yeah, this UPS Freight one has it. So you open the doors up, and it's all mouse control. go so then you can unload or load anywhere in the maps that you want you don't have to have these docks and then while I got your guys attention we're gonna flip over I'm gonna quickly show you some upgrades that I've made to this map so I'll start over here to the left so I can actually get into something so here is the sugar factory Then we have where well, we buy the grain because we're not going to do it realistic. Then we have the coffee plantation. This makes your caffeine for Coca-Cola. And here's all your sugar pallets. And then we move over to here. Oh, wait, we're skipping one. 
Here is the best one right across from Walmart is the Coca-Cola. We have our loading dock, custom made. I'll put the links to this in the description below. It is yeah, misc. It's all these right here, self-made brand. Got some longer docks. I custom made this and then used the creative tools that we got. Coca-Cola. Got a shed back here. I got one of the pallet racks. Got some priority mail. That's from... I can't remember which actual Facebook page, but it'll be down in the description below. Starts with an R, I know that for sure. Rebellion mod, I believe, if I'm saying that right. And then over here we have the, uh, if we don't want to spawn inside of it, we got the Whiskey Factory, Jack Daniels, actually made up some pallets last night, and we got another beer company over here, and we have another loading dock, this one's a little bit bigger because we, this is one loading dock for both, got the trailers, so here's this skin, Jack Daniels. Tennessee whiskey. I gotta actually get the correct truck for it, but just brought it over with a Coca-Cola truck. And then down here on field four is the original warehouse from uh, what was it uh, Wood Metal Farms? They had it in their Wood 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 Metal Farms map. I wish you would actually bring that map to 19 because it's pretty badass map and then we got the coca-cola trailers with the AC units so I hope you guys definitely check out the warehouse series I'll put a link in the description and put a picture up on the screen so what look to what to look for on the videos it's a very fun series I'm gonna try to get a multiplayer series but Probably for the next three weeks, nothing's really going to happen on the channel dramatically. I have earlier start times today on Cyber Monday, December 2nd. I have a 2 o'clock start time, which, if you know anything about UPS, anything over five hours is time and a half. So that's literally 7 o'clock, and we're not going to go on the belts probably until hopefully 9 o'clock tonight. So a lot of people are guaranteed seven hours, which is two full hours of overtime so that's time and a half that's pretty damn good so hope you guys enjoy the mod spotlight i enjoyed my thanksgiving break i like taking that vacation i get an extra eight hours on top of 25 hours for the vacation time so not too bad not too shabby and we'll see you guys later hope you guys enjoyed all the recorded videos thanks for the support we made november a great month for views plus obviously mod being, making all the money and stuff we can put that money back into the channel because that's what I do guys that PayPal account that is hooked up to this like YouTube account is building it up slowly with money and we can easily upgrade for channels we're gonna be buying a 3d printer hopefully with that money maybe a GoPro so if you want to support the channel just simply watch the videos and the ads will collect money revenue for the channel or whatever I need for my personal life because if you put the time and money and a certain platform or something like this has a reward you're free to do with the money whatever you want thank you guys for supporting the channel the internet company just finished one little section in my town so there is hope uh, they are getting done with it so hopefully by next year we can get the internet hopefully by the end so stick around. Thanks for all the support, all the new subs. If you're a brand new sub around this neck of the woods, definitely go check out all the other videos. I've been doing YouTube for five years now, so it's been an awesome journey. And we're going to keep on going. doesn't matter what YouTube throws at us. We're going to stay here right on YouTube. See you guys later.